Okay, g'day people, we are cutting out the shroom spoon today. Here it is, okay, so the first part is, over all usual, I'm gonna sort of like block out on the bandsaw, and because this is the fastest way to get rid of wood around this complex carving. Surrender. Myself, they call me J O A to the easy E. Yeah. Huh. Know that we undefeated, y'all are beneath them speeds. It's trying to air a grievance, but his lines are overhead. Better check the air for clearance. Call the tower, this is our credit. He the air apparent. Uh -huh. Really, I've never been better. Yeah. Legacy, this is forever. Huh. All the more times I've been seven, I'm raising the boy. You can go ahead and mess up. Yeah. Think about time for a toast. Yeah. Time that we walk through the goat. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, we're just leaving. I think about time that somebody go get on the coat. You know I got all that anthem. Come back in, what you call that ad all Got anthems and bands with masters. Getting them rights like my name was Miranda. Yeah. I ain't bigger dead than alive, I ain't bigger dead than alive One more time, this is forever, remember the legend, he never gonna die Yeah, I ain't bigger dead than alive Okay, so we are looking after little Amelia She is a little foster dog And she has had a knee operation So she is in six weeks of lockdown in her little cage She only comes out to go to the toilet So here I am, three or four times a day I carry her out the back I've made an awesome little toilet for her in the bush. And you can't watch her pay you, that's just weird. Okay, so there's her uh, knee operation there. Uh, looks like a bad haircut day. Okay, so we're kind of like halfway along, I think. Well, maybe maybe 20% along, I'm not quite sure. It's always, these are so hard to judge these kind of things. So I've kind of done a rough outline of the mushrooms, but I'll find that up. And now I want this to sort of like go up and down and weave in and out of each other. And probably the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hollow out the spoon. Okay, so to hollow out the spoon, I am using the Arbitec ball gouge. It's an awesome ball gouge. You can see that it's getting a bit rough there. All you need to do is turn it around so the ball is going down into the bowl. And that takes out those rough patches. And it leaves an amazing smooth finish. It's like a planer, you know, it's just, it's incredible. And it's really easy to use as well. So uh, if you're into spoon making, uh, power carving, it's probably the way to go, I reckon, that ball gouge. Okay, so that had to be one of the hardest cars I've ever done. It was that spiral in it. It was really difficult to sort of like get my head around where the cuts go and how to work out where it moves around like that. Down the uh, shaft of the spoon. Here's the uh, finished product all oiled up. And really like how there's that uh, sort of like lighter part and the darker part how that goes through the spoon itself so and the way it spins like that looks like the uh, spiral is going up the, the handle of the spoon anyway hey thanks for watching everybody hope you guys enjoyed it and girls and animals and uh, little rats puppet rats uh yeah hope to see you guys next time